The Army Regulation 600-20 defines hazing as any conduct whereby one military member or employee, regardless of service or rank, unnecessarily causes another military member or employee, regardless of service or rank, to suffer or be exposed to an activity which is cruel, abusive, oppressive, or harmful. The Inspector General of Regional Command East wants to know how you define hazing. Hazing to me means the degradation of a soldier for others' pleasure. To take advantage of somebody who's just trying to belong. It's almost like another form of bullying. Them doing their job is not enough um, to get there that they have to actually go through some type of initiation. Making them seem like an outcast, especially if they choose not to participate, or if it's involuntary, it's a way to alienate the soldier. It brings them down, it takes their whole morale, um, it can humiliate them and take them to a whole other level. You can go as far as uh, suicides, which has been known to happen. When you have a group hazing one individual, it kind of shows, to me, almost mental weakness. They're not showing that they're a strong group, they're showing that we need to abuse you in order for you to be a part of our group. Hazing has no place in the Army. Uh, from all ranks, it's unacceptable. All jobs, it's unacceptable. Any unit, it's unacceptable.